Kansas City Fire Department says it needs diversity among its paramedics. New at 6, our Andres Gutierrez shows us why the city is doing and what they're doing that is to make sure that that diversity happens. All right, paramedics are on their way, okay? Whenever a Kansas City, Missouri resident calls 911, there are more than 100 paramedics standing by to respond. I'm coming to, to help somebody on the worst day of their life, and if I can make that better, then I've done my job. There are now efforts to have paramedics reflect the city's diverse population. When you have a bunch of people walk into your home that might be of a different race or a different background, uh, it, it's nice to have somebody that maybe you can relate to, that someone that uh, you can look at and, and feel comfortable around. Which is why the city kicked in $25,000 for scholarships at Penn Valley Community College. The money is available to students in the schools, paramedics, and basic emergency medical technicians program. Hopefully we can get more local people that are interested in doing that and, uh, and just get a draw from uh, what we have locally here. Students who receive the scholarship must live in Kansas City, maintain a two-point GPA, complete a basic EMT course, and be willing to accept a job offer with the KCMO Fire Department when they finish. Paramedic has become a career and it's, it's starting to come up to that. While there isn't a shortage of paramedics right now, the fire department wants to stay ahead of the curve. So it's working with people. It's changing people's lives. In Kansas City, Andres Gutierrez, 41 Action News.